Hey guys, Seth the Shrinking Pastor here with my day 17. Holy cow, day 17 update. Um, it's been a couple of days since I posted an actual P90X update. Um, so let me fill you in on the last few days. Uh, Sunday, I decided to rest instead of do the stretch exercise. Um, it was just a busy day, Mother's Day. We were running around all over the place and uh, really I've, I've just been exhausted. And in fact, um, a couple of people I've talked to that have either done P90X or have attempted P90X before and, and have quit have said that week three is where it gets really tough. Um, each week has its own challenges. Week one, it was physically challenging because you're just, you're hurting. Week two was great. Your energy was high, but it was, uh, it, it was, you, you ache more in week two. Um, you feel great, but your, your muscles and your body's getting a little bit more tired. And so far, halfway through week three, um, I'm just exhausted. Um, and, and I think I've mentioned before, part of it is sleep schedule. Um, part of it is just being busy. I work at a school and it's the end of the year, so things have, have picked up. Um, helping my wife, who also works at the school, grade papers and um, getting ready for a baby to be here. All of that's keeping us busy and just a lot of, a lot of busyness. So, so I'm, I'm it's, I have said before that the hardest part of this exercise, and I think the hardest part of doing anything great and, and anything that's hard and challenging is the mental barrier of just uh, buckling down and deciding to do it, um, getting up in the morning and putting in the DVD. And so that challenge has gotten significantly more difficult this week. Um, and so the result has been I, I skipped stretching on Sunday, which is optional and that's totally okay. Um, I really, really pushed it on Monday with my chest and back, um, so much so that by the time I got to my abs, I was just exhausted. I made it halfway through my abs and I couldn't move. Now the half that I did, I did almost full reps, which I haven't done yet, um, but I just was so, so just tired. Um, my body was just tired. Um, and then yesterday, we had to get, go to school early for a meeting, and it was just one of those days where it was just busy, busy, busy all day. My plan was to go ahead and, and do my plyometrics last night. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, and by the time everything wound down, it was it was 10:30 that we were getting home, and that was just too late. So I decided to, to use yesterday as as my recovery day for week three. So I won't get to enjoy my rest or stretch on Sunday. Um, but uh, enjoyed it yesterday. Well, today, similar story, had a real busy day, so I didn't get to my workout until about 8.30. Um, a few things, I don't like doing it in the afternoon, um, especially something like plyometrics. I'm tired, and that's just, that requires such endurance that it's hard to do. Also, if you're going to do something like plyometrics, don't eat spicy food for dinner uh, beforehand. See, that's not a problem if you're working out first thing in the morning, but uh, if you're working out after dinner, it, it is. So I had a sub from Subway with uh, some spicy peppers, and it was giving me some heartburn. It was making me, I really think I would have felt better if I had thrown it up. Um, and it was making me gassy, which is also not awesome. Um, so all of those things, I, you know, it's personal. Um, just word to the wise, probably you should avoid that, um, especially on plyometrics day. Um, so I'm, I'm a day behind on my workout schedule where I would prefer to be, um, but again, it's gonna be okay because Sunday is is the optional day, so I just took my optional day yesterday. So today I did plyometrics. Um, tomorrow I'll do shoulders, arms, and ab ripper. Um, I'm excited that uh, Waffle, my brother-in-law, is gonna take a day or two um, resting and so by Monday we'll be on the same schedule for our recovery week which will be nice so we'll be able to to finish out the 90 days um, on the same schedule maybe get an opportunity to work out here or there um, finally welcome to all of the new subscribers from Aristocob pipe people um, all over the place thank you to everyone who's given me just such tremendous support and encouragement um, it really really means a lot to me especially on this week um, that has been the most uh, mentally trying and, and emotionally trying. Um, getting that extra boost of encouragement has, has really meant a lot. So thank you very much. Um, 
happy Tuesday, Wednesday, whatever day it is this week. Uh, I uh, thank you for watching and look forward to seeing you tomorrow.